Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. It's Yaley Quinones here. If you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button down below. And if you're not new, welcome back. But today I pulled together this look for you guys, a very vampy fall look because fall is right around the corner, the September the 21st. So I really wanted to get this look for you guys, even though in New York it is super hot and I hate this weather. Like I don't like the hot weather for real. It's just I don't I just can't do it. But yeah, either way, this is a look that is great for nighttime kind of clubbing thing you know if you have nice eyes this will make your eyes pop out so much i feel like this will look great on girls with light eyes and let's just get on into the video hoop, hoop, hoop. okay so to begin i will be using this yellow shade right here from nature republic i think i've talked about this one before and i will be using this kind of angled fluffy brush i like it a lot because it's not that dense so it's like very fluffy and soft so i'm gonna use this as like my transition shade yeah let me get some more curves i took a little bit off and you know the transition shade it just goes like into my crease and like above it a bit because it kind of like peeks through you can like barely see it on this eye but yeah that's how it looks blend it nicely now i am going to take the brown shade from the zulu palette i use this palette a lot because i actually don't have that much palettes i have like a good four palettes but they're not really like that special so that's I just moved the camera. That's why I use this palette a lot. So I'm gonna take that brown shade on the same brush, the ankled brush. I'm gonna put that in the crease area and a little bit blend it into the upper portion of my lid. And I kinda like clean it off and blend it, blend it, blend. So now I'm going to use a purple shade from the Zulu palette as well and I'm going to put that on the same brush, the angled fluffy one and I just put some like on the tip kind of because I'm just going to focus this on my crease area like that. It looks kind of harsh now. But that's why we blend and blend and blend. And it just darkens up the look a bit more. Like that, it looks a little bit too dark now. But what I'm going to do is take a clean fluffy brush. Actually, it's not that clean because I used it. <sighs> that's funny. But I'm going to blend everything. With the fluffy brush that I used to blend, I'm going to put that on that fluffy brush. And I'm just not going to wet the brush or anything. I'm just going to apply the product on my lid and like blend it up towards the purple. So like the color, you can barely see it because it's not that pigmented. But if I keep applying a lot, it will be pigmented. But for now, I'm not applying so much, applying so much because I want to have a nice blended look with the purple thing. I feel like this eye is going to look darker than this eye. But it's all Gucci. Now what I'm going to do is take more of that black onto that fluffy brush. You can actually use a flat brush for this. I think it's much easier. But I just kind of wanted to use this, the fluffy brush, because I wanted to blend it out as I applied it, kind of. So I'm going to spray it with some setting spray to kind of get the pigment going in that black shade. Let it kind of like dry a little because it'll be like really wet if you don't like that. It got like really wet, but it's okay. I'm just going to pat that on my lid only. And I'm just going to keep on going back to the black. If you guys know a good pigmented black color please let me know because this black ain't cutting it no more 
And so I just keep on pat patting that on my lid. And for this step, you don't really have to do so much blending because since I did the, the black before and I kind of blended it into the, the purple shade, it's kind of like already has that blended look. I'm just going to keep on applying more to get it as pigmented as I want it to be. Like so. And I kind of like drag it up a little bit to blend it a bit more and just so you can see it. Because, you know, I have hooded eyes. And, yeah. So, I do that. And now with that brush, I just kind of like wipe it a little bit. Not that much. I'm just going to blend everything and kind of make it darker. Because that's the vibe. <laughs> I'm so weird. That is the vibe that we have. So, as you can see, this is basically finished is just it's a very simple look i just use like about three four colors yeah four colors and yeah and it looks very nice it will look so much better like on people with nice eyes because it will kind of like enhance your eyes more but now what i'm going to do is like with this pencil brush is i'm going to take the yellow ooh, and i'm going to put that on my lower lash line and with the purple shade, I will be doing the same thing I did with the yellow. Putting it on my lower lash line. Just to get that smoky look. And I do drag that kind of really close to my inner corner. Because I want the whole lower lash line to be smoked out. But then I do take the black again and I just put that in the outer portion to kind of like blend the whole upper lid with the bottom. Now for lashes, I will be using the Kiss Demi Wispies, Kiss Express Demi Wispies. And a lot of people have been asking me where do I get these from and there you can just get them in your beauty supply they're like two dollars no more than four like i think it's just three something but yeah you just get them from your beauty supply and they're really good i really like the kiss ones i really want to try the ardell lashes but they don't really sell them in the beauty supply they sell them like i saw some in charlotte Ruth actually yeah, I'm just waiting for my glue to get tacky. And my hair looks a hot mess. So I will be popping these on. But yeah, as I said, this look is really easy. I feel you just have to know like how to blend it right and how to like not apply so much black I mean I feel like mine is really dark but it looks nice though I think if you pop some glitter on it will look really nice but I don't know my glitter is not gold gold and I feel like a nice gold will look good with this but now I'm gonna use the shimmery can you guys see it the shimmery color from the Zulu palette <laughs> I'd be forgetting and I'm going to pop that in my inner corner just to brighten things up and not to look so dark and evil <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.